A man is alive tonight thanks to the efforts of two first responders. Now this all happened Jennifer Thursday afternoon when police say the 911 call center was inundated with people calling for help during the heavy rain. 11 Alive's Molly Oak is live tonight. So Molly, how is that man doing right now? Yeah, that man is Bernard Johnson. When I spoke with him this afternoon, he said he's doing OK and just thankful to be alive. You know, it all happened right around here where I'm staying, standing. Police say it was on Thursday around 1:45 p.m. when they saw part of a car underwater near Peachtree Street. The Atlanta police officer says he didn't even realize a person was in the car until he heard people shouting. Then he saw an Atlanta fire rescue captain trying to get the man out. Now you're watching video we got from police as they break the man's window and pull him to safety. And then I started getting to my shoulder blades. And then um, the doors wouldn't open. I had a canister. I'm trying to smash the windows in. That wouldn't work. So now I'm like, now I'm starting to panic. Uh, he was just worn out and he was overwhelmed. Uh, we were beginning to be overwhelmed as well because we had been out there for a few minutes and you have uh, water that's well over four and a half feet. So, you know, you, you have to act really quickly. You know, no surprise probably, but when I asked the officer and the firefighter if they considered themselves heroes, because a lot of us do, they both said, no, they're just doing their jobs. When I asked Bernard that same question, he said, absolutely. Guys. All right, Molly Oak, thanks so much. And